Coke music. Oh, I fucking love that game. God, because that was like when Habbo was in its prime and then Coke music came out and you could actually make money and you didn't have to spend real money. You could make money by playing the fucking game, by interacting, by socializing, by playing your music, by making music. You got all these Coke caps. You bought Coke bottles. Guess what? You got a code. You threw that in Coke music. Guess what? You got a fucking couch. It was great. Coke music was awesome. That game was... Woo! Boy, that was a game. Where the fuck I am? Where the fuck I am? I really hope you guys played Coke Music. I really do. Because that was a game. That was a fucking game back then. Oh my god. Where the fuck I am? Sven Co op? <laughs> god damn it. Sven Co-op was a lot of fun, that's for damn sure. Online show up. Where the fuck I am? Damn it, only one hit. Toontown. I never played Toontown in its prime. I played Toontown late. I think I was a teen at the time. I played it really late. My friends were playing it, and I was like, what the fuck is a Toontown? I was like, alright, I'm down. And it was actually kind of fun. I never played it in the, like, early, early times. I played it, like, later. That was really hard with the iron sight. Do I look like a man that cares? Where the fuck I don't care that I have no sight. Let's do likes on Insta to get each other viral. Got 600k followers, D. Where the fuck I am? Uh, no. Holy shit, Kid Vicarious, what the? You just got a gifted sub. What's up, man? It's a name I haven't seen in a... Oh, a Forex. This name I haven't seen in a long time. Such good hits. He's so fucking low. Do you install WoW once a year? <laughs> yeah, just about. I don't know if I'm gonna play this expansion on launch. I played Legion on launch. Um, I have no clue. Maybe, maybe not. I don't know, man. This is the one expansion I just don't care for. Most expansions I'm like super stoked. I just don't give a fuck about this expansion at all. I don't know why. Really, dude? You're not going to stand up to kill me? You're just going to sit prone on that ridge? Alright. So be it. I can't see him. I know he's, I know he's prone on the ridge, but I can't see him, so I don't want to run up because I'll just die. It's 
so hard to leave this place because of all the snipers. I just wasn't really thinking. I just jumped. Said, fuck it. Let's see what happens. I don't know what it is about WoW expansions that just kind of like made me lose interest. But I was always super excited for a WoW expansion every single time, even though I didn't play. But, like, I will play this WoW expansion. 100% I will. But I'm just not excited for it. That's kind of gone. And I don't know why. I don't know what the reason is for that. You know? Thank you guys for the Twitch round. So, Hawkeye, uh, Palm, uh, look, 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 hi. Like, like how? Like, I don't know. What? One, why did my game lag? Two, how did I not kill him? Damn, this guy had some, had some shit. I'm down. Thanks. Holy shit. I might get off PUBG soon. I've been playing for like three hours. I'm kind of just like, eh. Where the fuck I don't know what else I'm going to do though. Could rainbow, I just it's hard to rainbow without a full squad. Where the fuck I am. I don't wanna be bad at the game. Please, Brendan. Ow, my dude. Why you do this? Run him over. Pretend to be a girl on RuneScape. Yeah, I'm sure that'll go well. I actually don't even, at this point, I don't even need to pretend to be a girl on RuneScape. I could literally just log on on RuneScape and people just give me shit. It's great, you know? That happened last time I played RuneScape on stream. I got like 100 mil. And like fucking so many runes. So many. Like hundreds of thousands of runes. I have like an infinite amount of death runes, fucking chaos runes, air runes, fire runes. Like it's... Unlimited amount of runes. Law runes. It doesn't matter. I I can't run out of runes. People gave me so much runes. It's stupid. That's how my magic is like 95 or something. 96. But I haven't played in a <laughs> very long time. Where the fuck I am? They're all following me. Uh, game, please. I wonder if this guy's trying to get closer, or if he's just chilling in his post. Or 
Oh, he's getting closer. Okay. I need him to get a little bit closer, and then I can. I'll take it. Not exactly the range that I was going for, but hey. It works, right? I need to get off the vector. I don't have enough ammo. Um. Yeah, we're gonna have to swap off the vector. Oh god, I don't know where he is. Where the fuck I am? Whoever play who who here plays Sherwood? Anyone know what I'm talking about? Sherwood. Sorry, bro. Best gun in the game. You can't win. Sorry, dude. Almost. I need to swap off, though. I'm sorry. I'm going to have to get off the best gun in the game. It's all ogre. Um, Alright, we're going to have to... Um, X ammo level three. All right. Cool. We're all good. That was actually pretty quick looting. Not bad. Anyway, as I was saying, um, you guys ever played Sherwood? You know what I'm talking about? Is that the one with the spiders? Yes, I mean, kind of. There was a lot more than just spiders, but there was a website um, called, it starts with an M. Fuck, I forgot what it's called. Mer 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 Meridans? Mer I don't remember. But anyway, it had Sherwood Online. It had Sky or Moon Base Alpha or some or Moon Base I don't know, Moon something. Um, it had a game where you were a tank and you were flying around shooting tanks with like those like really troll. Um, um, that one more game that I don't remember. Anyway, it's great. Where the fuck I am? Great. And the game still exists. I played it recently. Sherwood Online. I played it recently. It's a really, really troll game. Where the fuck I am? Made Marion? That might be it, actually. Made Marion. Yeah, I think that's it. Oh, Adventure Quest. Dude, that's the first game Where I ever had a subscription to. Adventure Quest. And I only justified it because it wasn't a it wasn't a subscription. It was a one-time. One-time, 20-something dollars, and you were subbed to Adventure Quest. Oh, dude. And then you got, like, the, the Adventure fucking Dragon Sword or whatever that spawned a dragon at random hits. Ugh. I love that game, Adventure Quest. Where the fuck I now am. it's all fucking weird. It's a weird game. They went. They're still trying to make it a thing. I don't know. Where the fuck I am? Where Tank the fuck ball. I am. Yeah, I think that's what it was called. I bet you you were aware fire. I don't think so. It's been a while. Adventure quest, man. Yikes. I played a lot of fucking games. Jesus, thinking about it now. Oh my goodness. Oh my damn. Oh my goodness. Where the fuck I am? Were you an Elder Scrolls player? Uh, I mean, yes and no. 
So I never actually got the chance to play Morrowind because when Morrowind came out, I was really young and I was really confused by it. I did not know what to do. I did play it, but I just didn't understand it. I couldn't. I couldn't understand it at all. Um, Oblivion, when Oblivion came out, oh my god. That was beautiful. That was my shit. I loved Oblivion. I, I own Oblivion like fucking six times. I own it on Steam. I own it on a, a Polish version because that was the first version I bought. I because I was in Poland when it came out. Um, I um, I own the the hard copy from Amer or Canada. <laughs> Fucking the DLCs and all that shit. I bought it so many times. It was weird. I barely played Maple Story, by the way. I did, but like not really. My friends were really into it. I was more of a fan of those free-to-play games when they were private servers. So like Maple Story, private servers, played it a lot. Uh, Cabal Online, um, I played it. I did enjoy it, but I enjoyed more of it in a private server. Did you grow up speaking Polish? Yeah, Polish was my first language and then I I learned English and then told my parents to only talk to me in English and then I never changed off that and now here I am. I don't know the language that well. I can understand it. Like if someone speaks it to me, I can pretty much understand like I would say 80% of what they're saying. Depending on I guess their lingo because some Polish is hard for me to understand. Like if we're talking like hardcore Polish, um, like I, it's, it's tough for me. But if we're talking like American slash Canadian Polish, like I could, you know, I could work with that. <laughs> Because then it's not as, like, complicated. There's a guy around here, and I'm scared. Because I feel like he's going to be prone around a tree and kill me. <laughs> Ouchies. Did you ever play Animal Crossing? I did, briefly. I never owned it. I played it at like a friend's house or something. I don't know. I don't know. Oh, level three's hit. Well, that sucks. I shouldn't have hit him in the head. Oh well. Interesting. Where the fuck I am? Did you play Knights of the Old Republic? I did, uh, but I didn't start until the second one. I think. Yeah, I think I played the second one. I don't think I played the first one. And it was really difficult. I remember. I struggled. I think I had to cheat a little bit. I think I cheated at the start of the game. Actually, I definitely cheated at the start of the game. I remember. It was too confusing to get a lightsaber, so I cheated to get a lightsaber at the start, and then I played the game and beat it. <laughs> so, <laughs> yeah. Guns of the Duel? Yeah, I played. And then I got ruined by cheaters. People shooting RPGs like fucking a bazillion times over and over unlimited ammo. It was, it was real fun. It was real good. Just infinite RPGs at you. It's great. But when it wasn't cheaters, it was fun because of like the combos you can do with the sword. Where the fuck I am? Where the fuck I am? It's crazy how like how much knowledge I have about games, and that's it. <laughs> It's really weird to think about. Like, that's my life. It's literally my whole life. And it's been my whole life for... Ever. Anything else, I don't know shit about. I like, very, very minimal. Like, even remembering stuff. Like, I remember just, like, almost anything about specific games. Because like, I played so many games when I was younger, but... 
other shit like real life shit not really i don't remember my childhood really i just remember playing games and i remember the games i played in detail but i don't remember like actually anything else <laughs> is that weird i don't know who's hiding in a house And victim number one. Oh god. Where the fuck I am? Also, Justin was talking about some jobs you had. What were they? Do you remember? Like real life jobs. I've only ever had like three jobs. And it didn't last very long. So my first job, which didn't really count, but I mean, I'll say it anyway, um, was working in construction with my well now stepdad so he was in construction and then he pulled me to help and i did that for about a week and Where hated every I second am. of it and said nope can't do this then i went out and actually went to like an agency that finds jobs um i think i was like 16 at the time or 17 or something um and then I worked in an assembly line in a factory that made like shampoo and fucking body wash. Um, and basically like the, in that assembly line, the girls like, they like, they made sure like everything was like secure, like the caps, like so they would check all the caps. They would, you know, verify that it's all good. And then it would go down to us. Um, oh no, then they would, then they would package it. I'm sorry. They would put it in a package and then they would put the package to us. And then we would, um, Where the fuck you know, like am? secure it. Oh, oh God damn it. Essentially we would secure it. We would fucking tape it up, put it on like a skid and then stack all, stack them all on like the, the skids or whatever. And then take this, no, we wouldn't take the skids away because we didn't know how to fucking use a forklift, but someone else would take it with a forklift. And then that's what I did. And then after that. Because I didn't like that either. Because it was so fucking far away. It was stupid. It was like an hour away. It was ridiculous. Like an hour and a half or an hour away to do that. And I was like, no, I'm not doing that. Then I found something close. Which was super close. Like five minutes. And that I did. I did that for a little bit longer. Um, it was like a furniture store. Uh, I didn't work in the furniture store. I just helped ship. Where the helped with the shipping am. part. Like loading the truck and unloading the truck with furniture. And then that's it. That's all I've ever done in life. <laughs> that's it.